We're going to talk about how your U.S. citizen or your green card holder child can help you to get a green card or lawful permanent residency here in the United States. If you have a child who is under the age of 21, can they help you to apply for a green card here through a process known as adjustment of status? The answer is no. Well, what about if you're outside of the U.S. and the child is here? Can they bring you here if they're under 21? No. What about if you've been told that you need a waiver to deal with issues related to past fraud or misrepresentation, or perhaps you've overstayed in the U.S. and you have unlawful presence and you now need a waiver to get over that issue. Can a U.S. citizen or a green card holder child help you with that process? The answer is also no. But what about if you are outside of the United States and you're going to be interviewed at a U.S. embassy and you have some sort of criminal issue in your background, and you've been told that you need a waiver to deal with it. Can your child here in the United States be a relative to allow you, be that relative that allows you to apply for this waiver to forgive you of this criminal issue? The answer is yes. If you're in removal proceedings here in the United States, you're going through deportation proceedings, um, and you need a, a waiver in court. Can the child help you in that aspect as well? Yes. Now, what if you're here in the United States and you're married to a U.S. citizen or a green card holder who has abused your child, either through battery or um, extreme cruelty? Can you um, get a green card that way? The answer is yes. And as a matter of fact, the child that is abused in this marriage relationship uh, does not have to be a U.S. citizen or green card holder in order for you to get your green card under VAWA. Okay. It could be an undocumented child who was abused, um, in this way by the green card holder or U S citizen, um, spouse of yours. Also, what about in the context of a crime? If your child here in the U S is a victim of a crime, can you get a green card through that process through the U visa crime victims process? The answer is yes. And like VAWA, the child that was, a uh, that is the victim does not have to be a U.S. citizen or a green card holder. Okay. Um, and then lastly on my list, this is just a list of my thoughts here, uh, summarized for you. Lastly, what about if you're in court and you are eligible for a process known as cancellation of removal, that will allow you to get a green card through an immigration judge. Can a child be used in that application process? And the answer is yes. So long as that child is a U.S. citizen or a green card holder under the age of 21. Now, what about if you have a son or daughter who is over the age of 21? Let's talk about that. A U.S. citizen son or daughter over the age of 21, what can they do for you? Well, first of all, that adult um, son or daughter of yours can help you to adjust your status and get your green card here very easily um, uh, through that family relationship. They could also apply for you if you're outside of the United States and bring you here to the U.S., what about if you've been told that you need a waiver related to fraud, misrepresentation, a crime, or something like that, or unlawful presence? Can that U.S. citizen son or daughter over 21 help you? The answer is no. What about within the context of VAWA, domestic violence? Can a U.S. citizen son or daughter over 21 help you? And the answer is yes. If they, uh, if the U.S. citizen son or daughter was the abuser, if that person abused you, you're eligible to apply for a green card under VAWA and get your green card that way. What about if you're in immigration court proceedings and um, you are going through cancellation of removal? Can an adult son or daughter U.S. citizen help you in that process? And the answer is no. Now let's talk lastly about green card holder sons, um, son or daughter over the age of 21. As you guys can see, uh, there are a lot of X's here. 
that adult green card holder son or daughter of yours cannot help you adjust your status. They cannot apply for you if you're outside of the United States. You're, you won't be eligible for any waivers through that uh, son or daughter. VAWA, you're not eligible either, even if that son or daughter abused you. And cancellation of removal in immigration court, you're not, you won't be eligible through that green card holder son or daughter. So um, if your son or daughter is only a green card holder, encourage him or her to seek naturalization if they are eligible. Like I always say, we've helped thousands of immigrants read our success stories at mcbeanlaw.com forward slash success or reach out to us at 516-866-3900 to book an appointment with one of our attorneys to discuss your immigration uh, situation. As you can see here from our list, we handle a lot of different situations that people face. Uh, we work on complex marriage cases, waivers, motions, appeals. We also do work in immigration court, cancellation of removal. We also do stay of removal, adjustment of status in court, removal of conditions, naturalization, VAWA, U visa, asylum, um, the widower or widow green card pathway, temporary protected status. If you've received a notice of intent to deny or to revoke your case, we work on those cases as well. And then we also do um, the green card process under the employment-based process for individuals like investors, uh, people who are who have extraordinary abilities, um, professionals, skilled workers, we do the O1A, L1A, um, H1B, and some other temporary visas. And lastly, friends, before you go, subscribe to my newsletter. Each week we send out terrific newsletters covering your immigration questions, um, immigration news, and some good news stories to make you feel good. So go to mcbeanlaw.com forward slash subscribe. It's free. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.